With John Secreto and Adam Lugabill from Comic Zone. <laughs> Both of these guys right here. We're gonna play a little more Heads Up, the game where we go to flickchart.com flickchart and compare two movies so that these guys can mess up my list of the top movies of all time. Uh, if you want to take a look at our list, flickchart.com slash variant edition and you can see where it stands. You know what? I have a suggestion. Yeah. Why don't you, if we're supposed to mess up your list, then you weigh in when we tie it. Oh, well, that's like my that's my benefit. Oh, okay. I get, I get right. to weigh in. All right, that's fair. Yeah, if you I, haven't I seen that. one or if it's a tie, I get to be the breaker. I was going to say a random number generator, but that's fine. <laughs> random number generator. <laughs> yeah. AKA a D6. Yep. <laughs> All right. I'm ready. First choice. Uh huh. Last action hero. All right. Versus Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters. Come, Come on. on. Come on. Ghostbusters. Obviously. It's an American classic. American classic. It's an American classic. Yeah. All right. I'm ready. It's not a classic. There's no reason to use the word classic. It's a, cla it's a classic. It's a classic. The Green Mile. Okay. You got it? So yeah. no. Go on. Minority Report. Ooh. Hmm. I would say I actually, Minority Report. I like Minority Report. I like Minority Probably. Report a lot. I, I, I think I liked it more than most people. I kind of feel the same way. I don't know if I like it better than Green Mile. It doesn't really matter what I think because you guys both picked it. <laughs> I do like that movie a lot, though. I just don't like sentimentality. I don't like when things have heartfelt things in them. <laughs> this is a joke. In that. <laughs> These are not true. <laughs> All right, I'm ready. Scream Two. Ooh, excellent. Versus The Little Mermaid. Whoa. These these Disney film comparisons are hard. It's hard to not hard. pick them. Uh, I love The Little Mermaid. So good. I love. I'm going with The Little Mermaid for sure. I like I like Scream. I like Scream if Two. If it was less. Scream, I would say Scream. It would be, it would be Little Mermaid. Little Mermaid. It would be I'll much, much harder if it was regular. Scream Two is good. It it's is good. But, yeah. It's quite good. Yeah, I'll say um, Little Mermaid. Yeah. It's the one when they're at college, right? And yeah. she's like a theater actress. She's a, a theater major. No, The Little Mermaid's about a little... <laughs> <laughs> All right. Under the sun. I don't know if you guys have seen this movie. All right, Either right. of these movies, actually. Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. Nope. Yes. And Ants. I've seen both of those movies. I haven't. Which uh, one do you like better? I I think I like Ants better. Yeah, clearly. <laughs> I mean, I like again, I, I like... Indiana Jones more than most people. Oh, you like that movie? Yeah, I mean, I like that movie, but Ants, I think, is very, very good and underrated because everything else gets compared to, like, Pixar. Made, yeah, every Pixar movie gets compared well, that Ants is not a Pixar movie. It, no, Bugs Life is a Pixar movie. Ants is not. It's a DreamWorks. Dreamworks. I thought you were saying everything gets compared yeah. to Pixar. But they do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, any kind of, like, you know, That's true. digital animated kind of thing gets compared to Pixar movies. Ants is actually very, very good. That's the one with Woody Allen, right? Or is that Bugs Life? Whatever. We'll, <laughs> <watch them next. laughs> we'll put it up. Um, Alien. Yep. Versus American Psycho. Here's the problem. You're always going to say Alien, regardless of what... It's like one of the like, top five greatest it. science fiction movies ever made. And? I mean, American Psycho... I, I think American Psycho is overrated. I don't really think it's got great. I think it's a good movie. It's not... It's a really good movie. I don't know, dude. I don't know. All right, so... I'm going with Alien. You're going to go with Alien, too. I'm going to go with Alien, too, but <laughs> American Psycho is a good movie. I don't like you saying this overrated. I don't like you talking about American Psycho that way. I'm going to go with Alien, too. We're going to have a whole American Psycho conversation Ooh, two later. two classics. I'm ready. These one, this time, they're actually classics. Okay. <laughs> Not classics like Ghostbusters, Ghostbusters. Okay. which is also a classic. Yes. Star Wars. All right. Versus The Great Escape. Oh, man. Ah, oh, Great Escape. I'm mm -hmm. going to say Great Escape. I feel like I have to say Great Escape, too, but... Not only do... I, 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 I've watched Star Wars a ton of times, and it's a good movie, but I would rather rewatch The Great Escape I've than rewatch Star Wars. I've seen Star Wars so Wars. many yeah. times. Yeah. And I mean, I know that's not the, exactly the criteria, but I feel like that's a good sign about a movie so like you're saying The Great Star Wars? Escape. I, no, I'm saying Great oh, Escape. I think I'm going to say Great Escape, too. I, okay. I, I mean, Star Wars is very good, but it's not, it's not really as... It's one of the most iconic science fiction films of all time. It is, it is but it's not really a great it's movie. Science I hate Luke so much in that movie. God, stop yourself. I'm glad that I don't have to make the decision. I like Luke better in the, in the second <laughs> movie. Because that would have been a tough one. There's a lot of eggs. No, there's not a lot of eggs. Got it. I'm ready. Okay. This is, this is all going to go. Anchorman. Right. The Legend of Ron Excellent. Burgundy. Versus. The second one's really good, too. I saw it. Shaun of the Dead. So good. <laughs> Two amazing movies. Shaun of the Dead's better. Of the Dead. it, Anchorman's amazing, and there's some yeah, yeah. great jokes in it, but Shaun of the Dead is just, like, perfect. Yeah, it's, an app. it's definitely a better movie. Okay. Zoolander. Awesome. Love it. Poop. Versus so good. Knocked Up. Knocked Up's great. Knocked Up is a better movie than yeah. Zoolander. I agree. I like Zoolander's that. not poop, though. No, no I whatever. love Zoolander. It's no, funny. Whatever. It's goofy. The files are in the computer. <laughs> <laughs> True Lies. All right, okay. that's a good movie. Lost in Translation. Oh, come on. 
Uh, Lost in Translation is better. Way better. Yeah. True Lies is great. Though. Lost in Translation I, I has like one of my favorite scenes in the history of movies. Okay, moving on. Which the, <laughs> the very last, the very last scene in the movie, I think, is. Oh, yeah, that's is a like good the thing. last like eight minutes of the movie are fantastic. Go ahead, let's move on. The Born Ultimatum, oh, yeah, which is the third one, right? Yep, yeah. that one wins. <laughs> in the Army Now, starring Paul Schrader. <laughs> Come on! In the Army Now, yeah. going Adam, with it. Adam Adam going with Adam it. Just, really? Yeah. No. Nope. Paul Schrader is amazing. Yeah, the Born Any, Ultimatum. Anything Paul Schrader is in is better than anything that Matt Damon has ever been in his life. That's just a 100 percent irrefutable fact. All right, let's let's go on. A movie from my childhood. Ask me about Biodome. <laughs> I love Biodome. Batteries not included. Yeah, okay. That's very I haven't seen that movie in a long, long time. Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, Never which is it. the first one. Uh, I like Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone better. I think like if I was a kid when that movie came out instead of a kid when Batteries not included came out, I would be way more excited about the Harry Potter film. Yeah, that's a tough one for me. Um, Although I do think that's the first one. That is the first it's one. Not, it's not a great movie. Not the best of the Harry Potter films. I still would go with that over <laughs> over Batteries not included. But I don't know. I, it's not. It is a tough one. I'm gonna go with Batteries not included. But Click. it's really close. Yeah. Not that close to me. Well, that's because you haven't seen it. Yep. All right. The Life Aquatic. Oh yeah. Versus 1989 Batman. Mm. Life Aquatic. <clears throat> Life Aquatic is a better film. Yeah. Batman. That Batman, Batman movie's pretty good though. It is very good, Not but Life well. Aquatic's such a good movie. It's great. I love it. Star Trek Insurrection. I don't know if that's works. A, what's that's a that's, random dude. That's a random one. It's the 1998 one. Yeah, that's like it's like Star Wars part Star Trek Part Seven though, isn't it? Whatever. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. It's I've seen it, but I haven't seen it in a long okay. time. Versus Babe. Oh man. You know what? I've never actually watched Babe. I've seen Babe. It's good. Okay. I'm gonna go with Babe. I'm gonna go with Babe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Babe's better. Star Trek. I can't remember the number. Which number Star Trek that is? That's like seven or eight or something like that. Yeah. I don't like, memorize these things, folks. That's what. Well, we'll put for. it up. That's um, <laughs> the Incredibles. Great versus film. Versus Kingpin. Nah, the Incredibles is so much better. So it's not much. even like those shouldn't even. They shouldn't even be next to each other. Hack the website and take that comparison out of <laughs> consideration. Hack. Hack the website. Terminator Two. Yeah. Judgment Day. I, I love, love that movie. Versus Star Trek Generations, which was the one with all the cap. With yeah, yeah, yeah. T yeah, Two is better. Way better. Yeah. Maybe the best acting movie ever made. Best. Second best. Second best. Die Hard. I mean, he just exactly. It's like, <laughs> like, like it's his job. Maybe the best action movie. Of it's all the time. second best action. Wait movie. until the first. <laughs> wait until the Born Ultimatum <laughs> comes up. He says, "Best action movie <laughs> of all time." Yeah, you're right. That one is better than both of them. No, no, it's not better than T two. It's not better than Die Hard. Die Hard's number one. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Earth Girls are easy. Die Hard <laughs> versus Big Fish. I, I haven't seen either. I haven't seen either one of those movies. You hated Big Fish, and you haven't seen Big Fish. I haven't seen Big. Fish. You haven't seen. Hated Earth is not Girls the right easy. word. I, I probably saw Earth Girls were easy when I was a kid, but I don't remember it. I felt like I'd that's seen the one with uh, Jeff Goldblum and it's still on Comedy Central like all the time. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, I've Earth Girls are easy. Was pretty good, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I liked it. I don't know. I didn't really like Big Fish that much. I, don't know. I felt like it was. I've seen it a hundred times before. That's Tim Burton, right? Since it then, is. I've seen it a hundred times again. Yeah, Tim Burton's made like one good movie. Big Fish is what we're gonna have to go with. Whatever, but I don't think we'll Rocky. Yeah. Versus the Nutty Professor. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, we're gonna say Rocky. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> come on, get serious. Get serious. Take the is that seat. actually a movie? Because I've never heard <laughs> get of it. Get serious. Yeah. It's like get smart. The get shorty. Get shorty. Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Get Carter. That's another movie with Get in it. <laughs> that is. Let's keep going with this. this is fun. Versus The Return of the King. That's the third Lord of the, the Rings. The third Lord of the Rings movie. That one. Yeah. I mean, I actually really like Hitchhiker's Guide, but I, I liked it too. Return. I didn't think it was great, but I liked it. Oh man. The Secret of My Success. It's I, love, I love that movie. Love that's, that movie. That's, that's from my my childhood. The Flintstones. That movie's not good. I don't think I've seen either one of those. Secret oh, of really? My Success. Is very Secret of My Success is really good. I think it's very good. I would do Fox. Being all cute. Yeah. Love that. Never seen it. I love it. Taxi Driver. Oh, man. Gangs in New York. Whoa. I like Gangs in New York better. I've, I've watched both any number of times. And I, I mean, Taxi Driver is a great film. I don't really enjoy watching it. It is kind of painful to watch. Um, and Gangs of New York is just... I okay. Mean, Can we take this a step further? Sure. Better performance. <laughs> Robert De Niro in Taxi Driver or Daniel Day-Lewis in Gangs of New York. I... I think Daniel Day Lewis maybe. I would not I would not be able to make that decision. I, it's They're really tough. amazing. I think I, I think I go with Taxi Driver on both occasions. Okay. You're going with Gangs of New York? I really I let me tell you I something about make, Daniel Day Lewis. It's amazing. <clears throat> I think Gangs of New York, I would pick. And I might even pick it on 
Which one's better? I think Taxi Driver is held up to a level that it doesn't actually meet when you watch the film. He's, he's talking crazy. Okay. <laughs> he's talking I, crazy. He's, crazy. It's amazing. he's putting crazy on the internet right That's now. What I think. <laughs> That's what I think. Okay, I'm going to go with... So difficult. <laughs> I'm going to go with Gangs of New York. Come on, what is going on here? It's really hard. I don't want to walk off the set, so let's just move on to the next Okay, thing. this is... <laughs> This, this is, is the last one. one because this one's too easy, so okay. it won't be the last one. All right. <clears throat> this is the penultimate. Okay. <laughs> the Exorcist. Okay. Versus From Dusk Till Dawn. All right. The Exorcist is a better movie. Yeah. Well, that, that's that's not even a question, really. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I figured. All right. I like From Dusk Till Dawn, though. This, this one's the last one either. <laughs> <laughs> the Butterfly Effect versus Gone with the Wind. Ashton Kutcher versus Cary Grant. <laughs> wow. Butterfly Effect, obviously. <laughs> it's not Cary Grant. It's Clark Gable, right? Clark Gable. I always get them confused. <clears throat> Okay, last one for real. Okay, Ocean's 12, which was the second Ocean's movie. I like that movie. Versus Hannibal. I did not like that movie. We're going with Ocean's I thought 12. That you, I thought that Ocean's 12 was the one with it's the one Julia. I hate. It is the one with <coughs> Julia Roberts playing herself. Playing herself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you no, hate that. No, you no, I that. like that movie. I hate it. I, I, I don't like I don't like Lots that. Lots of pointing! Come Lots. on. <laughs> I know you went into a huge rant about Julia Roberts playing herself and meeting herself and that being like the kind of thing that you hate the most. I, I in do. Film. I do hate. You that. hate that okay. so much. All right. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say that I don't like Hannibal either. I like Ocean. The Ocean movies. So I'm gonna go with that by default. Ocean's Twelve. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I would have probably gone with Hannibal. Here's the thing about but Hannibal. I really hated Ocean's Twelve, yeah. and like the other two movies a lot. I like yeah. both the other ones. Yeah. I just did not like that movie. Yeah, I liked Hannibal just yeah. fine, but uh, I think again. Like, it's not Silence of the Lambs. It's not no, even it's not. Red Dragon. It's yeah. just kind of... <laughs> okay. Okay, we'll do one more. All right. All right. I, like, <laughs> I like this one. I saw right. it. I Don't like... peek again, though. All right, I'm okay. Gonna... Batman Begins okay. versus Wedding Crashers. Wedding Crashers is so good. It's so good. It's so, so, so good. I love it. I, I don't it. like it as much as most people like I it. I love it. So these are two movies that I'm not actually crazy about. Uh, I would say Batman Begins. I like Batman Begins. I, I like it more than Dark Knight Returns or Dark Knight. It's called Dark Knight. The Dark Knight. Dark Knight. Yeah. I Batman like. Be, yeah. Batman I mean, Begins better than. The I, Dark love, Knight. I love. I love both of internet. these movies so much. I'm. I'm. I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with Wedding Crashers. <laughs> All right. Well, it's an easy decision for me because I like Batman Begins way more than Wedding Crashers. Okay. Cool. All right. All right. Heads up. Flick chop. <laughs>